Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I am here to share our Costco haul with you guys. So if you are new to my channel, my family and I, we go to Costco two times a month. We go for the first half of the month and then the second half of the month. We take out $250 cash um, for each half of the month, which includes Costco, but it also includes eating out. So this is for the first half of June, and we kind of split it up a little bit. Um, usually in the first half of the month, we do a lot of snacks. And then in the second half of the month, we do more like meat and things like that. So let's go ahead and get started because there's a whole long line of things to show you guys. So the first thing we picked up was these organic black beans right here. We also got a case of corn. This is gonna be for like Mexican rice um, or Spanish rice and um, like taco salad, taco soup, things like that. And then we also do our own homemade black bean burgers, which are delicious. Let me know if you're interested in that recipe. They are really, really good. And then we got some mac and cheese for the little one and some single serving cups of oatmeal for my husband for snacks. I picked up some of these Crunch Master multi-grain crackers. It's got sesame seeds, uh, I have no idea how to pronounce that, <laughs> flax seeds, chia, quinoa, and millet, or millet, I don't know, I feel like I can't talk today. But um, yeah, so I got some crackers. We got these little chia squeezes for the little one as well. Um, we're gonna see if she likes them, if not, we'll eat them, but we're gonna give those a try. And then we always pick up fig bars. That's a staple in our household. Every single month we get these. They're delicious. Then we've got some egg whites. I like to mix the egg whites with like a whole egg um, from like egg scrambles and stuff in the morning. So there's that. And you can also add egg whites to like protein shakes and stuff like that. Um, you don't have to worry about like cooking it or anything like that. It's perfectly safe, so that's nice. And then I got a big old five pound thing of clementines because I am obsessed with these currently. We got a rotisserie chicken. I like to tear all the meat off the bone and then put some in the freezer and use it for like chicken enchiladas, chicken noodle soup, um, just to put on salads, to do in wraps, things like that. There's a lot that you can do with this. We checked out like the meat that's already torn off the bone and it's insane, you guys. So this chicken is like $4.99, and for the meat that's pulled off the bone already, the rotisserie chicken that's pulled off the bone, it's like $12.49. It's like double, more than double the price. Um, so I was like, we're gonna tear it off ourselves, because that is insane. Um, we got some sea salt. These chips are amazing. These late July sea salt multigrain chips. These were on sale for $2.50 off, so we picked up those. And then the Boom Chicka Pop popcorn, which is delicious, was buy one, get one free. So we got two big old bags of that. Our whole family likes that. And then we've got the Dave's Killer Bread, two loaves. This is definitely the best price on this bread. It's $7.99 for two loaves, whereas like you can get one loaf at the grocery store for like $5. So really good deal. We leave one in our bread box and then we leave one in our freezer. And then we got 60 cage-free eggs. These were $8, I wanna say, and there's five dozen here, so that's a good price. So we got those. That will last us probably the whole month. And then we got some animal crackers for the little one. She got to pick out her own snack, and this is what she picked. We've got some taco seasoning. Um, that is obviously for you know taco meat, taco soup, all that good stuff. We also have this fully cooked bacon. I've heard really good things about this. I haven't actually tried it yet, but I know um, Kimmy from, um, she's in her apron, and someone else uses this um, bacon and they were raving about it. So I wanted to give that a try. And then we got some maple syrup, definitely the best price for maple syrup at Costco. Um, this was $10.99 for this big old jug of it, and it's really good. And then we've got some sliced cheese. This is for like cheese and crackers and then, you know, sandwiches, wraps, um, grilled cheese, things like that. Love Tillamook. And then we've got the pitas. We use these for homemade um, pizza and then just for like pita and hummus for a snack. 
plain Greek yogurt. We use this as a sour cream substitute. I also use this to make pancakes and I use this to make uh, pizza dough. So we go through this pretty quick. Um, and then back here we've got, this trail mix is delicious. It's so good, the protein trail mix. Um, I've had it before, we haven't had it in quite a while, but I wanted to get this for a snack. So we got a big old bag of that. Whew, I feel like I'm out of breath. <laughs> <laughs> I'm telling you, the belly's feeling like so big today. But um, okay, and then we've got the Daybreak blend. This is for smoothies, and also my daughter really likes to just snack on frozen fruit um, in the summertime in Arizona. That's really good. I also want to try to make some popsicles with this, so we'll see how that goes. And then I've got this organic triple berry blend as well. We can use that to make popsicles, but I really also like this on uh, yogurt and oatmeal. So we're going to try that. And then the last thing we picked up was this uh, Vega One All-in-One Shake, the chocolate flavor. This was $10 off, which is a really good deal. Looks like it's got really good ingredients. So I want to give that a try because I do want to start trying to drink more smoothies. I feel like they're just really easy for me to drink. And my favorite smoothie is greens, chocolate protein powder, banana, peanut butter, and almond milk. So good. So I think that is everything. <laughs> lots and lots and lots of stuff to put away, yay. <laughs> um, and then our total down here was $249.76. We did not, oh yeah, we got paper towels too, but that's over there, I'll, well, I can. I guess I can show you the paper towels. You wanna say hi? Hi. Hi. <laughs> let's, let's get the paper towels. <laughs> So there's the paper towels, can, can I see two? which came from our household budget. Can I see two? <laughs> yeah. Um, ignore my messy kitchen. But so the paper towels, we did not ring up as a separate transaction. So household owes our food money probably like 18 bucks um, if you count tax. <laughs> so in total, we spent like 231 on our food money. I also used my personal money for this, I decided to pick this up for myself using my personal money. So, um, cause we did go out to eat before we went to Costco and use some of our food money for that. So our food money is now gone for the first half of June. Um, and then we also don't have any money to eat out. <laughs> so no biggie though, right? We'll be okay. Yeah, we are gonna be okay. Yeah. <laughs> So anyways, guys, that is it for this Costco haul. If you guys like this video, please let me know by giving it a thumbs up and I'll keep doing and the Costco the hauls. <laughs> you wanna show them the pretty picture that they drew? Let's see, let's see the pretty, oops, you wanna get? Let's see the pretty picture they drew. Look how cute. I love them there. But yeah, so if this is something you guys wanna see, like I can show you guys every Costco haul. We go again twice a month, so there'll be two videos a month. So definitely let me know. And if you have any questions, comments at all, let me know in the comment section down below. And if you haven't subscribed already to our channel, definitely hit that subscribe button, as well as the bell notification to get notified every time we post a new video. And I will chat with y'all later. Bye. Bye. <laughs> Tell us you all later. Bye.